San Diegans leaving the White House this morning. And here they are in a face-to-face -face meeting with U.S. Representative Juan Vargas in his Washington, D.C. office. We don't make enough for me to get financial aid, but we are also not living comfortably. The delegation from the San Diego Community College District includes the chancellor, other officials, and student leaders from each of the district's campuses. Sejel Dape Gotra is a second-year student at Miramar College who wants changes in the law to bring equity to financial aid. The federal Pell Grant, um, wanting to adjust it to the cost of living in the area in which the student resides rather than having a standard um, like a bracket set for the whole entire nation because people live in different regions with different levels of income and poverty. The students have been in Washington since Monday, touring and talking with California lawmakers who can help make a difference in their educational lives. Chancellor Greg Smith says in-person communication makes a difference. And we find that having our students come and tell their personal stories takes us out of the realm of policy and puts it into the realm of human impact that's going on right now, which um, our legislators responded very positively to being able to hear those stories. Students heard a lot too. Those in favor say aye. aye. Those opposed, no. no. The college students happened to find themselves in the U.S. House of Representatives Tuesday when Congress debated the impeachment of Secretary of Homeland Security Alejandro Mayorkas, and they got an earful. Just remember feeling the tension when the clock was striking down um, onto their time to vote. Um, there were names being yelled across the room from both sides saying, vote, vote, vote. It was like a sports game. Besides being student body president at Mesa College, Ixchel Valencia Diaz is studying political science with a heart for undocumented immigrants and asylum seekers struggling to enter the U.S. She's a student and an activist on a mission. I personally felt like I had to advocate for San Diego for the border town of families that come in. When Ixchel finishes her studies here at Mesa College, she plans to apply to a four-year university in Los Angeles and then on to law school, where she hopes to learn the language of the law fluently. She leaves our interview with inspiration and one last thought. Si se puede. Oh, si se puede, because I thought I couldn't. M.G. Perez, KPBS News.